Hey guys, I'm Ryan Dungy. I ride for Team Red Bull KTM. Uh, well, we're here for the 2013 launch of uh, the bikes, riders, and uh, introducing all the new 2013 uh, 450 SXF that I currently ride. So, myself, Marvin, Kenny, just a little bit of an introduction for uh, what's to come for 2013. Being in my first year here and, and, and signing with KTM, you know, I knew we had a, a, a lot to accomplish. You know, I mean, obviously they, they made a commitment to, to come over here and three years ago to do whatever it takes, you know, and, and I knew they were serious seeing the people that they were hiring, the changes that they were making, and, and so signing with KTM, I knew that uh, it was it was pretty much clear cut. You know, you, you're, we're hiring you to win. I'm stuck to be part of the Red Bull KTM team because for me that's the, the best team out there, and uh, I've been racing for for, for them since uh, when I was uh, in GPs, and then I moved to uh, to US uh, with KTM too. So. It's great for me and I signed for, for two more years, so I'm really looking for, I have more experience in the US, so now I'm looking for some win. We have the best guys out there, everybody's putting in great, great effort and, you know, and the work, you know, they're staying here from early morning to till, till late night to, to trying to get the bike better and just doing everything they can and, you know, it makes me really appreciate their work and, you know, we're definitely going for the win. I'm John Hines with KTM North America. I'm the product development manager and we're here today to tell you about the launch of the brand new 2013 KTM 450 SXF Factory Edition. One of the key developments on the new Factory Edition is the new engine cases. We've removed the Kickstarter boss from this area so there's no longer a Kickstarter available on the motorcycle. It's electric start only and what that does is actually removes about a half a pound of weight from the motorcycle. These guys use this in the heat of battle in races and, and clearly there's a competitive advantage to be able to if you, in the event of a crash to get back on your bike, hit the starter button and, and be off and going again and not lose any time. One of the other key things we did is add a new titanium Akrapovic exhaust silencer. By changing this out with the, the stock silencer, we reduced the weight of the motorcycle by almost another uh, entire pound. So this bike is, is a pound and a half lighter than the 2013 450 SXF. Again, as you ride the bike, you can feel the, the difference in the weight. It helps the bike handle and corner better, gives it a lighter feel. One of the key components to the, to the factory edition, of course, is the orange powder-coated frame. We've got black Excel wheels, silver spokes. We've got an orange anodized uh, rear sprocket, a gold Regina chain, uh, a special Italian Saladella Valley seat, orange anodized triple clamp. We've got the factory start, as well as a front brake discard. We've produced the best possible package for Ryan and the team to go out and win a championship in Supercross and also we've got the best possible package for, for you as a customer to go out and, and win at the local level. I love the bike, I love the new one and as soon as I, I jump on the new one, I mean a new bike, I, I love it right away. Oh definitely stoked uh, on the new bike, you know, um, it's totally different than 2012. Pretty big difference. I'm pumped about how the testing went lately. So, have a pretty good uh, suspension setup. The engine is really good. You know, it's all about uh, putting in laps and you know effort on training. And you know, definitely gonna be ready for NIM one. Now we are we are just uh, testing and trying some new stuff. And um, Ian Arison, Raj Tikasa, everybody are trying to, to make the bike uh, better. I mean, always. So that's great. It's already good, but uh, we are working hard. I feel like we've made those necessary changes. To, to help us in the 2013 and of course I can sit here and, and say that um, and say how great it is but really for me aligning up on the racetrack at Anaheim 1 in January is that that's where we're going to know the big the big test. The goals for 2013 is um, you know none different than before. You know, it's, it's to win the championship in both motocross and supercross, um, 
and win races. You know, I, I guess those those two. You know, it's it's a lot of races in between each one. You know, being consistent, and, uh, being there every single week, and then um, you know can't really afford any big mistakes. My 2013 goals are pretty simple. I just want to win Supercross and Outdoor. That's my goal. That's where, why I put all the effort in. And I think that's the team's goal too. So, you know, we're definitely going for the win. Now the team has more experience and they are, we are all working really good all together. And I have two good teammates, Ryan and, and Ken. A great group of people and it's been such a blast to, to work with them. And so yeah, like I said, new bag, new season, more experience. So. We're looking for this new season. Hiring me was a small step as far as you know, getting this whole team together and making it full. But um, as far as going out there and winning, you know, I knew we had the right people behind us. They hired all the right guys. They were going to do whatever it takes. And and uh, and, and myself, I was going to do whatever it takes. You know, and thankfully we had a, a very healthy off season coming in. Had a great first year um, winning. Uh, our first Supercross and then also turning that into four Supercross wins and then outdoors winning 10 of the 12 outdoors and walking away with our first championship and you know I feel like we've we, we accomplished a lot but but yet there there's still a lot that we, we haven't did that we're uh, out to accomplish as well so I guess uh, this year you know hope to accomplish the rest and, uh, and just keep building that in the history books you know for, for other riders to come and many years to come keep moving KTM up to that number one manufacturer in, in the sport of motocross.